the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's Arsenal, and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined, as always, on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It's Arsenal facing Barcelona. Well, Derek, we've got some of the world's top players out there tonight, so this has to be a great game, doesn't it? I just hope we see both sides play to their full potential. I can't wait for this. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Gabriel plays alongside William Saliba in central defence. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. This is what we think for Barcelona. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And now the Champions League final commences. Declan Rice Havertz Yuri and Timber Gabriel Martinelli They're wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward Martin Odegaard with it Havertz gives it a go and hits it with authority close Rafinha and a strong tackle the possession keeps on changing hands that's problematic that's about his opponent to get past him An encouraging move from Barca. Plenty to like about Martin Odegaard, his approach to the game, his ability on the pitch. What do you expect to see from him in this match? Well, he's such a creative player, both with his passing and his ability to beat defenders. He'll have a big influence today.
White. Havertz. It's with Erdogan. Good distribution. Rafinha, Pedri, Danny Olmo with it, Pedri, really getting stuck in. Marcinelli. Tremendous vision. Christensen. Arsenal have it back. Bukayo Saka. Really clever pressing. Declan Rice and support available and the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did Alex Balde Arsenal did well to win back possession Gabriel Martinelli Rice with it Martinelli, and now Havertz, that's a good ball, cross blocked, the breaking decision goes the way of Barcelona, Danny Olmo, Kunde. Lewandowski. Well read to ease the pressure. He's driven in the corner. No nonsense piece of defending. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? Martinelli. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Well, it looks so promising, but it all comes to nothing. Advantage, Barcelona. And that's great work to keep it in play. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. There is Redding in the centre. Oh, this looks useful. Well, they kept their shake defensively. Job done for now. Declan Rice. He has teammates around him. Marcinelli. And an astute piece of defending. Rafinha. Balde. Here's Rafinha. And as you can see, it's been really tight. And neither side has taken enough hits going forward. Hopefully that will change soon. And then we might get some entertainment. Yes, a stalemate so far. Will that situation change? Can he get them in front?
White. Now with Havertz. Saka. Now with Erdogan. Rice with it. Well, he's given it away. Kunde. Crucial interception amid impending danger. There will be one minute added on at the end. Well, it's all about passing as they try to hit the front. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. And the referee's whistle. That will conclude the first half here at Wembley. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Lewandowski, can they forge ahead? Well, they were well done, had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And over comes the corner. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Figueres defending. Now this could be productive. Well in there to tidy up. Thomas Partey. An encouraging Arsenal move. An important interception. Rafinha. This looks promising. Lewandowski. Who can he pick out? It was though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. the situation defensively and did his job how about the cross a glorious chance a oh, really commanding goalkeeping good officiating waiting for the play to stop and now going back to caution him Well, it's a bad miss. He really should score there. Gabriel. Gabriel Martinelli. Timber. Arsenal's free kick here. And the substitution will occur now. Martin Erdegaard. 
It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Saka, both with his movement and finish. That's a very good goal. Well, look at Arteta's celebration. He really is loving life at this particular point. It's a good moment for the team as well. And Barca get the ball moving once more. How will they react? Danny Olmo. Balde. a perfect challenge Declan Rice Timber Gabriel Martinelli it's a good looking ball and he's apparently veered into an offside position Stuart well that's tight really tight but he was just too anxious to make his run he was in though Twenty minutes remaining. Chances on. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans! A trophy coming their way, surely! Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick, and the finish is so clinical. He just rolls it past the keeper, cool as you like. <laughs> 2 0 now, and back underway. Torres. Martinelli. Kunde. Effective challenge. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Alex Balde. a good looking ball Kunde that's a good pass a bit of work to do in getting to that through ball the goalkeeper error from the keeper will they seize on it well breaking at pace is always a possibility And short it is. He takes aim. Well, catching it sweetly, but not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Well, it's always a difficult technique on the volley, but I think that's a massive chance he should score from.
Havertz. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Plenty of support here. Danny Olmo. Oh, a tremendous vision. Really fine play to keep possession. And that's the end of that move for now. Counter attacking chance. Barca recovering possession well. Rafinha. Pedri. And it's with Inigo Martinez. Here's Rafinha. possession Martin Odegaard Thomas Partey Yuri and Timber Partey a magical moment for Arsenal fans everywhere your old club have just been crowned champions of Europe well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Arsenal, the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon as they savour the moment with their supporters. And they've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. <laughs> and it wouldn't be a big final without photograph time. Yeah, and these photographs will be cherished for years to come. Really top-class scenes here.